Gracious, gracious gesture from the retired number 12, Joe Namath, to wear. A new era begins here at MetLife Stadium. The Bills and Jets underway to Fire. close out Fire. week one. And no run back on this one, so the new season will begin at the 25-yard line. Now here come the Bills for their first possession, led out by their 27-year-old quarterback in year six. It's Josh Allen. And it just feels like Allen has the Bills on the cusp of something. Allen going to go to the air right away. And his throw here is incomplete. So for the Bills, Charles, a lot of people see them as the favorites to unseat Kansas City, not just as AFC champions, but potentially as Super Bowl champions. You take a peek at their first month of the season, Jets tonight, home for the Raiders next. And the Jets push it to watch as down he goes. Multiple players combined for their team's first sack of the game. And when he went down, it looked like that right ankle got turned, but thankfully he popped up okay, and they breathed a sigh of relief on that sideline. So after the sack, Allen and the Bills with work to do on third and long. Mm -hmm. Looking to throw. Allen setting up the screen. Harris. And he gets it here by around the 24 before he's out of bounds. They'll get eight, but they're going to have to punt here on the opening drive because that's not enough. On fourth down, here's Sam Martin on to kick it away. Back deep for the Jets, McCall Hardman. It's taken to the 26. Six-yard return after a punt of 48. And the Jets will take over. So peel back the curtain and let the show begin here. Here we go, partner. After 244 starts in a Packer uniform, it is the first start here in New York for the new. Just started. I'm getting my axe. I'm scared. Now a play fake here on first down, and this will be incomplete. Physical play on the football there on second down. Here's second and ten. Now it's Rodgers. This pass out wide the hole. That he's corralled at the 40, but not before picking up eight. They need two. Here's third down. To throw, it's Rodgers. Wilson's got it complete. And they needed two. They could only get one. Fourth down. Still leaves him with fourth and short. Any chance to go for it? It's definitely in the back of my mind. In fact, I've discussed it with my staff all week long, different situations that I may want to go for it. Where's the ball in the field? Do I have confidence in my trigger guy? What am I going to do? I'm also talking about my analytics department. What are the odds? If I don't get it, what's it going to do to me the rest of the game? Personally, I end up taking all that. Only all coming Throwing the first down is Allen. It's complete to Diggs. It'll be a gain of five, and it'll be second down. A gain of five brings up second and five at the 31 yard Allen going to throw. Got it complete to Khalil Shakir. And they bring him to the ground just shy of midfield. First catch of the new season for him, and he picks up the first. That's his first catch of the game, and an impressive one against multiple defenders. And how about that start? Really aggressive. Yeah, there was double coverage out there, but that didn't stop them at all. They went right at it and defeated it on that play. And that one blown up quickly, as he's going to be stopped before he can even get started. And a stoppage here. We're going to need to take a moment as a jet was shaken up on that one. Boy, fingers crossed here. First quarter of a new season already an injury. And we'll, we'll step aside. From the gun, it's Allen. That's caught by his tight end, Dawson Knox. Oh, my God. Get 11 back on that one. It leads to third down. So third and two. This quite possibly four down territory, though, if they're stopped. To the air, Allen. Able to find the open man. That's complete. And he is going to have a Bills first down by a couple of yards as they're able to get four there on third and two. 
We've seen quite a bit of the short passing game here early on first quarter, haven't we? We have, and I think it works a couple of ways for, for this team because, number one, you throw the short game until they stop it. And if they're not going to stop it, you keep throwing it, and occasionally you'll break a tackle and turn into a bigger game. Also, if they start to creep up, start to pressure receivers, now you go over the top, take it deep, and now you get some of those big shots downfield. We are now second and four. And now some motion before the snap. And this will be our first penalty of the night's proceedings. And maybe they were coming with a blitz that time, and it caused a jump. I think if we saw it, you know that they saw it. Might have been a little discussion down there. Bad guys coming. Pick them up. Pick them up. And someone jumped. Now Allen throwing on second down. And he can't find anywhere to go with it. And he goes down. Jermaine Johnson credited with that sack. Well, that's the second time he's been sacked so far in the first half. And if they have designs on having a big hit, not going anywhere, they've got to find a way to keep him up right so they can throw the football. Oh. Now Allen. And not enough on the throw that time as that one is incomplete. Maybe a little over-anxious in the pocket there. He just didn't look comfortable on that throw. No, he didn't because it wasn't his normal fluid delivery. And I think you might have had it right. He wasn't really confident with what he saw downfield and almost felt like he wanted to pull that one back. This one angles out of bounds in a good spot in the coffin corner. And they're going to mark this out of the five-yard line. Oh, Back near the goal line. Here's Rodgers. There's a short one caught by Uzama. And this is going to double their room to maneuver. Able to get it from the five to the ten-yard line. Here's a second and five. Rodgers going to throw. This one complete to me, Cole Hardman. A five-yard pass on first down and another five-yard connection there. Throwing is Rodgers. And he's going to be brought down. Back at his own six-yard line. And award that sack to Boogie Basham. And they weren't in zone coverage. They were in man, and each man did his job. And that looked like vintage, old-school coverage, didn't it? Man coverage reminded me of an old Raiders team. They had a Hall of Famer at one corner and a Defensive Player of the Year at the other, and they just locked people down. And they need to work to at least get some of this yardage back after the sack. Second and 19. Throwing now is Rodgers. Open man here is Conklin. It's a big play that time by the Jets. 46 yards. No score after one on EA Sports. Second quarter now from MetLife Stadium. The Jets with the football here. So the line of scrimmage moves all the way across the 50 now as they come up first and 10. Now the second-year man back from injury. It's Brees Hall. And not a whole lot of room to operate there on the first down run. He gets maybe three. And hold on here, because on that last run, it looks like we have a player who was shaken up. Boy, you always hate to see injuries, especially tough here in week one. Just hoping this is nothing serious. We'll take a quick timeout. Rodgers to throw on second down. Throwing middle, and it's complete. And he's got a first down as a tackle made at the Bills' 34-yard line. Here's Rodgers. This pass going to be caught by Hardman. So the completion good for six yards. And it's second down. One thing you're hoping for when you run drag routes, you're able to hit a receiver in stride, and he can pick up a lot of yardage after the catch. But in this situation, the defense was effective, able to stop him before he could get a good head of steam going. Rodgers. And his throw is going to be incomplete. He didn't just deny a big throw there. He broke that one up in the red zone. An excellent play, one that may help save points on the board when this drive is over. Again, they'll throw with Rodgers. And he is caught. And he is going to have a Jets first down as he'll be marked down a yard or two past the marker following a gain of six. First 
down. Rodgers. This is caught. Touchdown. Tyler Conklin. A 22-yard touchdown grab. And the Jets go coast to coast and finish the drive off with six points. As a general rule, quarterbacks don't want to lock in on a receiver before the ball is snapped. But in this case, based on the matchup he thought he was going to get, it was favorable for his tight end. He locked in on him early and found him for a touchdown. Zerlon good with a PAT. And it's now a 7 nothing game. So that one a pretty time-consuming 10-play drive. And it ends with a Jet touchdown. And from the end zone, Deontay Hardy will bring it out. And the decision to bring it out, not a good one, as he's tackled at the 15. Here's the Buffalo offense. Allen now on first down. And it's incomplete. Boy, he doesn't drop many like that one. Second down. Now a second and ten. Allen going to fire quickly and get it to Diggs out wide. They do get a couple, but they'll be left staring at a third and eight coming up. They'll be in search of eight yards here as they hope to convert the first down. Throwing is Allen on third. He's got his target. That's complete. And he is going to have a Bills first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. That's a play that will likely be forgotten when you talk about big moments in this game. But plays like this are critical to keep drives going. And if points result, we'll call this play significant. Here's Allen on first and ten. Little pitch and catch to the tight end, Knox. Give him a gain of five on the completion, and it'll be second down. Brings up second and five at the 32-yard line. Allen now looks to throw. Has his man, it's Shakir. Six yards to pick up, and that's a first down. It's a gain of six. First down, Bill. Now a first down carry for Harris. Bryce Hall there defensively. That's a really good game right there. They pick up five yards halfway to a first down. The only problem now in the huddle, everyone's going to want to touch the football. Be a lot of chattering now because they've seen that they can move the line of scrimmage. It's had a throw on second down, but this one is incomplete. Fair to say it hasn't been his best game throwing the football, but also not getting a lot of help out there either. Yeah, you kind of you nailed it pretty well, you know. He's got to throw it better, got to get more help. Obviously one that should have been caught. They got to find a way to bring those, those two elements together so they can make some progress in this one. Now the throw on third down, knocked away and incomplete. Well, this first half has not gone according to plan so far offensively or even defensively for that matter. They could use a big-time spark somewhere, but it's not going to come on this drive as they have to punt this one away. And this one hits at the three and then bounds into the end zone for a touchback. The New York set to take the field. And one of the things we like to hit on every year... On first and ten, here's Rodgers. Finding Hardman here over the middle. And he's going to get this one across the 30-yard line. Nice way to start the drive, a gain of 12 and a first down. Two minutes on the clock, second quarter, 7-0 ball game. No one has ever questioned the speed of Hardman, who used some of it to get a first down there. He and the Jets, both hoping that the change of scenery could unlock a new level of production from it. Throwing on first down, but this one winds up to be incomplete. I see the surprise in your face there, partner. That is a rare incompletion from him. He's been on point this entire game. He has percentage completion-wise way up. Not that time. A rifles one, and that's going to be intercepted. Teron Johnson able to pick it, and they take over. They'll set up shop at the 46-yard line. 
So this defense coming up with a takeaway, and maybe that's something that can bring a little life to that sideline. Well, I don't want to say that they've been sleepwalking through this first half because that's simply not true, but you're right. We haven't seen a lot of fire from these guys, really, on either side. So after the INT, it's Allen. Out to the left, he's got his tight end, Knox. So the completion good for seven there. And that will bring up second down. Here's Allen. That's caught by Gabriel Davis. And Davis will have a Bills first down as the tackle made down at the 33. Now Allen setting up the screen, Harris. And he will lose yardage back to the 34-yard line. He was unable to shake free there. They'll cover him for a loss of a yard. Second and 11. Throwing now is Allen. He's got his target. It's the tight end, Knox. And he'll go out of bounds inside the 15-yard line. That one, a gain of 20 and a first down. Boy, everything clicking on this drive. He's four for four now, and that throw may be the best of the bunch. This offense is really humming, and they pick up another first down. Operating from the red zone now, Allen. Shakir hauls it in. Now the Bills are going to use the first of their timeouts as they'll stop it with 27 seconds remaining here in the second quarter. Under pressure again, and down he goes again. Now the Bills will use the second of their timeouts. So that means they're down to one remaining here as we head toward halftime. Now throwing on third down there, but he cannot connect. Oh, that's going to hurt a bit because they needed to come through the completion there. Now a drive that started with great field position is facing fourth down. The kick by Bass is good. And they are on the board, but still trailing. It's 7-3. So, Charles, they get to them with their first turnover of the game and then make it hurt a little bit extra with a field goal. And anytime you give the ball up, what's the first thing a coach tells his defense? Don't let them score off of this. You've got to put out the fire. In fact, in 2021... And they're just going to run it here up the middle. And he'll just push his way forward for a few. All right. One fatigue becomes any kind of a factor as we are back underway in the second half. On the return, it's Taylor from his end zone. And only able to get this to the 19, so probably should have opted for the touchback. Here's the Jets offense now getting set to start off this third quarter. This off Rodgers now on first down. A short throw to Conklin, the tight end. And yeah, that's good for a gain of six, and that'll bring up second down. Brings up second and four at the 24-yard line. A solid gain of seven yards that time on the keeper and a first down. The teams have a tough time running the balls this one has throughout this game. It's so easy to just say, forget it, let's throw the football. But that's exactly why you stay with the running game. Eventually, you stick with it, you make some adjustments, you often find ways to run the ball better as the game goes on. Yeah, he's able to push his way forward somehow for a gain of about two yards. Second down now. Rodgers now to throw. And that one to the right side and incomplete. And when you're in a one-score game in the second half, now's not the time to force the football to places where you shouldn't. And that's a smart decision to just get that one out of there. Throwing his Rodgers on third down. And that's caught inside the 30. The 
That's a big play there for the Jets on third down. 41 yards. I don't care what level of football you play. This one was a universal, wasn't it? When we were kids and we played touch football, remember we get in these positions and you just say, everybody go along and hope someone would come free. So now then, the big play has them all the way inside the 30 now, first and 10. Rodgers going to throw. Locates Hardman for another catch. We'll go down as a gain of six, and it'll be second down. Again, they'll throw with Rodgers. Completes it to Hardman. And he's going to be marked down just outside the 10. Give him 10 yards there as this offense is on a roll. This drive continues to plunge forward. Rodgers now on first down. That's complete right side to Lazard. A minimal gain there on the eighth play of the drive. Now second and nine from the ten. On second down, a run with Hall. And running room hard to come by here. He gets it down to the eight. A gain of two there on the heels of a one-yard pickup on first. So seven yards from the first down here as they come up to the line of scrimmage. And he is going to lose yardage here. This defense not budging back-to-back -back carries of just two yards. Well, we saw a lot of negative plays that resulted in plenty of lost yardage in the first half. And that trend is continuing here. So Rodgers will depart and on is Greg Zerline for the Jets' field goal. From the right hash, and this one just a chippy. Zerline's kick is up and through. And they push the lead up to a touchdown now at 10-3. Well, looking at it from a defensive perspective, that keeps the deficit very, very manageable. You know, all things considered, not a bad job on the defensive side. I would say that you've pointed out something pretty good right there, and that is you actually have both sides happy with that exchange. You know, happy in quotes, of course. One team, hey, we've kept, kept it within. First down, and they're going to throw with Allen. There's Stephon Diggs for the catch on the slam. And he'll be taken down, but not before they work it across midfield. 28 yards the game there on the catch and run. Oh, that was a nice job there. Quarterback and receiver reading the pressure that was brought. They both knew it was going to open up the middle of the field. Nice little shake and bake at the line of scrimmage. Got right into his route. And the quarterback hit him in stride, and he was able to run free after the catch. So in jet territory now. Here's first and 10 at the 47. So the shotgun snap to Allen. He'll find Diggs once more on the completion. And he's taken down inside the 30. Another first down as he went right back to the same well, this time for 17 yards. It's taken a while for this offense to get going. A little creaky at the start, but they're oiled up now. A nice throw there, and they're really putting together a good drive. Oh, he tries to force it in, and it's intercepted. And the Jets are going to have it here as they'll start at their own 24-yard line. So the ball changing hands on the interception, but meanwhile... Now Hall to start the drive. And he can only manage to get a couple. Second and eight coming up. Now a stoppage here as we've got a bill shaken up on the play. While the medical staff checks on him, we'll step aside in this week one contest. This is second and eight. Now Rodgers. This pass going to be caught by Hardman. Just a gain of a couple there. And now third down and six to go. They are in need of six yards here if they hope to move the chains. Shotgun now for Rodgers. Oh, he had him. He was open, but he couldn't get it to him. It's incomplete. So it doesn't look like they're going to be able to build off the turnover. Well, the defense certainly did its part. It got them the football. But you're exactly right. It looks like they're going to have to punt this one away. 
and it's not a turnover, but doesn't it feel like one after grabbing the momentum with the defensive play? Yeah, and they had all that momentum after getting the football, and now zapped right back in the other direction. That'll go as a 42-yard punt, but a net of 32. They had a 10-yard return, and the Bills will take over the football with a first and 10. Trying to shake off the interception. He'll look to throw. He's got the hook up with Diggs. And he'll be taken down, but not before he works it past the 50. That's a good way to start the drive. 17 yards and a first down. And it's pretty evident that this passing game has been frustrated so far. They haven't really moved the ball the way we might have expected. But this is a good pickup here for the first down. On first down, Allen. And he is going to be taken down. And that should be the final play of this third quarter. John Franklin Myers just would not be denied. That's a loss of seven. One quarter remains here as we wrap up the week on a Monday night. We'll return with more after this. You're watching the NFL on EA Sports. Pass protection has been a problem all night long as they come up facing second and a bundle. Now a give, running left is Harris. And he's going to take this one down inside the 45. That was a good run, probably right on the edge of breaking into something really big. So the defensive guys right now are talking about, okay, what can we do to slow him down before he truly gets started? Going deep for Diggs. Touchdown, Bills! Stephon Diggs with career touchdown number 60. And the Bills are an extra point away from tying this game here on the fourth. And we are set up for a fantastic finish now. A fourth quarter touchdown here. We're an extra point away from a tie football game. And I know they're thinking about possibly going for two, but I'd go ahead and kick this one and just get it back to level. With Tyler Bass on for the extra point attempt. And we are tied here in the fourth quarter. What a start to the season this has been. Back and forth, all tied fourth quarter as the kick is away here. Taylor now from the end zone. And no chance to get away as they get him down at about the 17-yard Now a play fake. Rodgers. And that is incomplete. Took a shot there on first down, but he couldn't reel it in. Second and ten. Throwing now is Rodgers. And this is going to be intercepted. Teron Johnson able to pick it. And this return is going to be halted right around the 28-yard line. Well, we say it often, Charles, but not all interceptions are created equally. And that is a big one here in a tie ball game in the fourth quarter. And Brandon, when games are this close, it usually comes down to the team making the fewest mistakes. And that was one of our mantras back at Tennessee. Coach Major say all the time, the team making the fewest mistakes will win. You've got to cut those down to give yourself an opportunity. The football back to the... So after the INT, it's Allen. Works right side into the hands of the tight end, Knox. And down inside the 15, shy of the 10. 16 yards there, and the Bills have a first down. Allen. And he's going to have to eat this when he's down he goes. Jermaine Johnson now with his second sack here on opening night. And this dominant defensive performance continued on that play. This poor quarterback has now received the protection he needs and has had to pick himself up off the turf far too often. Here's Allen. Working the middle here. That's complete to Knox, the tight end. Short completion, just four yards. And that's going to lead to a third and 11. Backed up here. Tough spot. Needing 11 yards to pick up the first. Flush to his right. Trucks over him. Given nine on the play. And it'll be fourth down. That's a good effort there, trying to do it on his own. But as a defender, you're in a tough spot because you have coverage responsibilities behind 
you? And if you take off too quick to try and get him down, he might loft it over your head. So better to track with your man defensively than try to go up and make a stop on the quarterback. Exactly right. What you're hoping is that your guys in the front seven can get him down. So here we go. Maybe the biggest kick of the game forthcoming. This to break our fourth quarter tie. The kick by Bass is good. And the Bills have taken the lead here in the fourth. So the drive here ends with a field goal. It does give them the lead, but this one's still certainly a long ways from over. It definitely puts a lot of pressure on your defense to hold the lead, right? They're happy to have it and happy to be out there trying to do so. But I know as a former player, in the back of their mind, they're thinking, why don't you score the touchdown and seal this thing? The New York set to take the field. And now they find themselves trailing. They'll start on the ground. Hall. And they're able to swarm him behind the line. And his rough night continues. Officially, it's a one-yard loss. That's going to bring up second and 11. Here's Rodgers. Throwing for the out route, he finds Wilson. They'll give him four yards there. Third and seven now. Working from the gun, Rodgers. Able to find the open man. That's complete. And he is going to have a Jets first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. Tell you what, he's been able to put the ball in some tight spots all game long. That throw, no different. Yeah, a lot of people would call it a gutsy type of a throw. I think he looks at it as, I can do it, so it's not that big of a deal to me, and I'm going to keep firing. Throwing on first down is Rodgers. He finds Wilson. And taking it across midfield and inside the 45. Three points separating these two sides with two minutes left to go in the fourth. So it's Jets football as we get you reset here. Plenty of time. All three timeouts still remain. Here's first and ten now. Rodgers throw into the hands here of Hardman. And he's going to be out of bounds down around the 35-yard line. Now second down and a few inches. Ten yards on the pickup. Rodgers to throw. He'll get this one complete to Davis. Well, they picked up a little bit of yardage there, and now, in this situation, should be in no hurry to run a play really fast. Let the clock wind down. First and 10 at the 34 yard line. Now, Rodgers. And bringing it in, it's Davis. Haven't heard much from him all night, but welcome to the party, making his presence felt in a big way. They've kept him under wraps all night long, but boy, did he find a great time to bust down. Here's first and ten. Back to throw, Rodgers. He takes it across for the touchdown, and they've taken the lead late. has been and what a drive that was Charles to take the lead here late in the fourth quarter and partly that's a job well done by everyone from the players to the guys calling the plays and if I may introduce just one downside to the mix might be a little bit too much time left enough on the clock for a final last ditch effort to try and steal this win away now Zerline on and the extra point And that will make this a four-point game. So that one, an eight-play drive. It spans 75 yards. And it's capped off by the late touchdown that puts him out in front here in the final minute of the contest. And they'll start this drive just across the 30. Pretty nice work on the return. Allen and the Bills now. Down 17-13. A little. Throwing Allen. And he went nowhere. He'll lose yardage. 
Pitch back to the 29. Now the Bills are going to use the first of their timeouts. Now Allen as a stopper with just over 40 seconds to go in the game. The pass caught by Hardy. Well, this one's had a season's worth of thrills already, but it's still week one. Here's third down now. Allen. That is caught. And he is going to have the Bills first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. Now the Bills will use the second of their timeouts to throw as Allen. That'll leave them with just one remaining in this fourth quarter of play. And not a whole lot there. Maybe three yards on first down. Here's Allen. And he can't get a throw away. He's taken down. The Bills are going to go ahead and use their final timeout. Throwing is Allen as they stop it with 14 seconds to go in the game. That one too wide and incomplete. Two huge plays there down the stretch. The sack on second down. Now they force the incompletion. That's going to lead to a do or die fourth down. And now that they've got the confidence right now that no matter what gets thrown against them, whatever play gets run, they have the ability to show. And he's blocked down. Can't do anything with a football. It's a sack and a turnover on downs. They had to go for it with such little time remaining. And the Jets are going to get the football here in great field position. Rodgers will take a knee here, and that should be all she wrote. In primetime games, they always seem to have a little bit more electricity, a little more anticipation, a fun one tonight, and a lot of fun ones that we have on the road ahead. And, partner, I love the word you just used there, electricity. Things were crackling out there, weren't they? And let's face it, both of these teams came in with the idea, get off to the start. Get off to a 1-0 start and get your season going. That could spark an excellent season for them 